It's the leafy green plant that is so ingrained in our culture and counterculture. Marijuana. Pot. Weed, man. It's legal in the Netherlands. That's where this video comes from. But it's still illegal in most U.S. states. But that didn't stop Marilyn Monroe. This old film actually surfaced just this week. And Hollywood historians and Maryland fans are all in a tizzy. In central Louisiana, there's a way to get that tingly feeling of a high, like Marilyn had. But you don't have to hit the streets to find it. It's a product that's being sold locally and legally at an Alexandria smoke shop. Here's the product in this little plastic bag, like pot comes in. But this is meant to be a potpourri, and it's called Supernova. They, uh, they, they classify them as incense, but everybody knows they're, they're not using them as incense. They're using them as like mine alternate substances to smoke. Abdullah Geis owns the Oasis Hookah Lounge in Pineville. He refuses to sell Supernova or anything of the sort. He says these kinds of spices give businesses like his a bad name. And we've been here for three years, take it free, no problems with no cops, no underage smoking, nothing like that. So I run a very strict business and I don't put up with no nonsense and nothing like that. Supernova is sold at $27 a gram. We tried to interview some people who roll it into joints and smoke Supernova, but everyone we spoke to declined to go on camera. Surprise, surprise. But you guessed it, Supernova and blends of herbs just like it are coming under scrutiny in at least two states, Kansas and South Carolina, and soon they could be banned and pulled off the market. So Supernova, Spice, Diamond, Teddy Bear, Gold, all that stuff is the same exact thing. They just changed the name up because the government and everybody is trying to hurry up and ban it, but all these companies are finding loopholes around it. In Alexandria, Mike Magnoli reporting, News Channel 5.